One of the ways you can get the edge in game, especially if you're playing competitively, is by customizing the settings to suit the type of game you're playing. Let's take Call of Duty Mobile, for example. This is a fast paced game that requires fast twitch reactions. And as a result, you want a smooth, responsive image with fast touch response. By selecting the Game Enhancer menu in game, you can then select Game Mode. By default, there are some presets here. Performance mode will make refresh rate and response time a priority, but will drain the battery faster. Balanced, as I'm sure you can imagine, aims to offer performance and good battery life, or battery life preferred will limit the previously mentioned settings in favor of keeping you gaming for longer. However, if you select the custom option, you will see you can go much deeper. Here you can manually select the max screen refresh rate. The higher the refresh rate, the smoother the image, which in a game like Call of Duty Mobile, where you need to very quickly change direction to aim at your target, then it's imperative that you have that crisp, clear image. You can really notice the difference when you go from 60 hertz to 120 hertz. Furthermore, you can tweak the touch response and the touch tracking, allowing for those fast twitch reactions to be read accurately for the best responses in game. And if the concept of touch response is a little hard to understand, think of it like a gaming mouse or an analog stick. The better the response, the more accurate your movements. These settings can also be adjusted on a per game basis. So if you jump from something like Call of Duty Mobile, which requires those fast responses and good performance, to something a little more slow paced, you won't necessarily always need to crank everything up to the max. So being able to customize this on a per game basis just gives you all the options you could ever need. If you want to learn more about how you can adjust the image quality settings for your game, then that is what we'll be covering in the next video.